do. And I've been down one time. And I've been down two times. I'm drowning. I'm drowning in the sea of love. Don't 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 Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, y'all. I hope we are getting welcome to the mental house with me, your host, Khadija. And I hope we are getting just a tad closer to stripping. Every great accolade off of this crook that we possibly could be. Because he's arrogant and he's pompous. And he had the nerve to ask the judge to dismiss the charges, the civil charges, from his welfare scheme scam saga. Brett Favre, who used to play for my Green Bay Packers. Let me let you know something right now. I hope they prosecute your big head ass to the fullest. A Mississippi judge shot down a request from Brett Favre to have a civil, his civil charges dismissed from his ongoing welfare saga. Mr. Favre is accused of being involved in what is the largest welfare fraud case ever in the state of Mississippi. $80 million in funds were fraudulently transferred from Mississippi, TANF, um, temporary, that's the Temporary Assistance for Needy Families Program, to this person. In her first major order in the ongoing welfare fraud case, Hines County Circuit Judge Faye Peterson denied former NFL quarterback attempts to dismiss the civil charges against him. Peterson also blocked Favre's request for a hearing on his motion, saying it was unnecessary and calling his legal arguments unpersuasive and inapplicable. Absolutely. You damn right. You damn right. Brett Favre has tarnished his reputation irreparably after involving himself in this damn scandal. The former Green Bay Packers quarterback entered the Hall of Fame and he should be taken out. He should be taken out. Pete Railroads can't be in the Hall of Fame. Brett Favre's ass needs to be out of the Hall of Fame. He's a damn crook and he stole from the poor. What is wrong with y'all? He needs to go. He needs to be... He needs to be reprimanded. He needs to repent. He needs to be held accountable for his lying ass and his dubious, unscrupulous practices and his disregard for poor people. Yeah, he needs to be punished for that. Because I'm sick of these. Never mind. But now that the curtain unveiled itself, Favre and his reputation have gone down the toilet. So it's not surprising that after he learns of the news of the sports world, reacted the way he did. Good luck. Lock the welfare king up. That's what somebody said. We're gl glad. Good. <laughs> somebody said lock the welfare king up. Good. He knew what he was doing. I'm just here so I won't get fined. Welfare case judge shoot down Brett's attempt to dismiss the charges. Great. And that's and that's good. Um somebody else, Baroness Maga Van Tickle. Great. Please make an example out of him. Please. Please another fan play it. Make an example out of him. Yeah, I agree. I don't think for one minute that he should be allowed to get away with this and be business as usual. He's gone from being my favorite quarterback. I, I, even though 
Aaron Rodgers replaced him. Um, I will give the mantle to him in terms of uh, the quarterback for Green Bay Packers. This dude is just a bona fide crook, a, a shyster, and an evil man. That's what I that's what I take out of this. This is an evil man. Anytime you steal from poor people and babies, so you can have to benefit yourself and to put your name or to put a have a new gym so your daughter could play volleyball. And all the millions and millions of dollars you made from playing football. I mean volleyball for your daughter. But all the money you made, how dare you? You big ass crook. And I, listen, I'm I'm happy. Join me if you feel like, and even if you don't feel like that. Leave your comment below and tell me what you really think about Brett Favre. Is he still a hero in your book? Is he still a hero or is he a damn zero? Because, mm-mm, mm-mm. As far as I'm concerned, he is a straight zero. When you have done to the four the least of these, and what you have done to the least of me, these, you have done to me.